Uh, we just, I really come together as a group. Uh, we had a great, a great summer, excuse me, great summer working together. Um, you know, just drill work. Everybody's out here every day working hard. And uh, everyone's starting to get the offense really well and, and get the speed of practice, the intensity that we go about, and just coming to work every day. So we had another pretty good day today. Got a few things to fix, but, you know, we're just coming together, and it's a, it's a good sign. They're in better shape now. And, and then sometimes what you got to do is, cut it down and get leaner and then build it back up in muscle. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So um, some of them are, you know, a little heavier than they were last year. You know, Mason Woods has kind of transformed his whole body. Mm -hmm. he, he really looks good. Um, but they all do. They've all gotten stronger. They're all a little quicker. They all understand the offense better. So, um, you know, it's just encouraging. Do you think it took that extra time to, to really build it up, um, the, the muscle, you think? Yeah, yeah. probably it did. And, and then it just takes – sometimes that, that group, it's – takes more time to learn a new offense too mm -hmm. and and sometimes also in that group you just got to get a little bit older and mature and tougher you know mm -hmm. sometimes it takes a while to just grow up i just think that we're tired of losing i think we were trying to knuckle down and everybody's bought into the system it's the second year we know what to expect um coach sink he's, he's doing a lot of technique with us which really helps a lot of the like especially me from being a new new guy on the O line, mm -hmm. but I just think everybody's bought in. You know, they're a year older. I do think they've got some pride. Um, really, by the time you add the junior college transfers that came at mid year, there's really 11 guys that probably think they should start. Mm -hmm. Only five guys will start, and so right there, we're going to get improvement because you got to be on your game every day. We really we went in and we shuffled the deck from last night's practice to tonight based on the performance yesterday, and we have that luxury now. When Coach got here, he cut us all down pretty good, and we've all been able to pretty much maintain that that body type that he wanted. And everyone's in pretty good shape right now, and uh, we're we're out here moving around well, so it's it's good. You just have to be athletic to play a line. I mean, people think it's just these big guys plugging up holes, but it's not. I mean. Um, the best alignment are some of the best athletes out there. If you really watch it to the tape and break it down, um, and that's that's the nature of the position. That's the way the game's going. And, and regardless of how big, strong, fast you are, you have to be athletic, and you have to have all those attributes to be a good player. The coach thinks coach for a long time. He knows how to control the room. He's a great teacher. He's mm -hmm. a great fundamentalist. And so usually whatever position he's coached, he does a really good job. And he's just a great coach, so they're going to be better. Dr. Spear helps us with our, we test the body fat on these kids twice a year. So the last 18 months and we get it done here. And, and we've had kids that have gained uh, like 21 pounds and, and their body fat went up like one and a half percent. That's really good, okay? Uh, we've had guys drop their body fat and gain weight while they've been here. That's really good, okay? Because there's the whole deal where you're removing fat, which is obstruction to good play and you're putting muscle on, which helps us. So we've got the numbers, and then now we need to make it show up on the field, and I think it will.